Hi, today I'm going to make uh, eggs over easy using the traditional diner style uh, basted egg technique. So I have melted about a tablespoon and a half to two tablespoons of butter. have two eggs, large, and uh, the butter has come up to temperature. So what I'd like to do, there's a little lip right here, and I just put a piece of towel to help so it's easier to clean. Just crack the egg and drop the egg in. When you drop the egg in, you don't want to drop it very high or I'll splatter. Just keep it low to the pan. Crack the egg. So with the uh, basted eggs, especially sunny side up, basically you're not going to flip the egg. You want the egg whites to be thoroughly cooked but the yolk some people like it runny and that's how i what i think about sunny side up eggs but the idea with the uh basting technique is you use the uh hot butter to cook the whites you want the whites to be cooked and the yolk to be uh, warm but runny The heat is on uh, medium right now, but for tender eggs, I'll move it down to sort of a medium low. Usually it takes about uh, three minutes to cook basted eggs. Gently let the eggs simmer. and just spoon the butter on top all right it's been about three minutes the yolks look to be set So now I'll just a uh, plate. Just use a little spatula and gingerly lift them out. All right, here are two eggs, sunny side up. All right, here's an alternate method. Instead of uh, basting with butter, you could lightly um, butter the pan, crack the egg, and drop it down low to the pan. I'm just using uh, medium low heat, sort of gently cook the egg. So instead of uh, basting with butter, I'm going to use a little water to uh, create some steam, about a little teaspoonful, and then just cover. And this will steam the egg and cook the uh, whites. All right, it's been about 30 seconds. You can see the white is still pretty runny, so I'll cook it some more. Just want to make sure it's not sticking. I'll let it go another 30 seconds. 
All right, it's been another 30 seconds. One thing I've noticed when I do use the steaming method, the uh, whites or whatever's left on top will kind of uh, start cooking. So I could have probably left it, took it off sooner, the lid. But the whites look like they've set. One thing about uh, the steaming method is it's a little less hands-on. You could just make sure the you have enough butter so the eggs don't stick. Add a little water, cover, and let it cook. While the uh, butter basting method, you have to be physically uh, active. But you could control the way the eggs look a lot better. This is definitely a lot more uh, loose than basting. So I'll just let it cook with the lid off for another 30 seconds. But the egg white is set. So roughly 30 seconds, uh, let it cook, add a little about a teaspoon of water, half a teaspoon of water, cover. It would have been, I let it covered for, kept it covered for a minute. Could have probably used a little less, 45 seconds. Just keep checking. But that should be done. Two steamed eggs, two eggs steam basted. semi sunny side up. All right, here are my eggs sunny side up. This one was uh, basted with butter. You could see the uh, bright uh, yellow yolks. Egg whites are cooked. And here are my uh, steam basted eggs. The egg white is cooked. Uh, one thing about steaming, as I mentioned, it'll start cooking the top of the yolk. So if you're looking for a nice bright yellow yolk, might be uh, better to uh, butter base. But if you do the steam method, you just have to keep watching it and make sure the white's set, but not the uh, top where it turns uh, slightly opaque. Let's take a look at the results. Nice white set yolks. The yolk here is runny, but it's you can tell it's uh, cooked nicely has some consist consistency and viscosity. This is the steamed egg. Nice runny yolks. Cooked whites. Both are good. Just two different ways to make eggs sunny side up. Enjoy.